China Media Group CCTV. This year marks the 70th anniversary of the establishment of the National People's Congress, NPC. Mr. Spokesperson, over the past seven decades, what important experience has been drawn? And on the new journey of advancing Chinese modernization, how will the system of People's Congresses better leverage its institutional strength? Thank you. Thank you. 全国人民代表大会成立七十周年人民代表大会制度理论和实践创新。推动人大工作取得历史性成就。人民代表大会制度更加成熟、更加定型。Thank you for the question. This year marks the 75th anniversary of the founding of the People's Republic of China. It is also the 70th anniversary of the establishment of the NPC. Over the past seven decades, the system of People's Congresses has come a long way, grown a lot, and provided an important institutional safeguard for China to create the turn miracles of rapid economic growth and long-term social stability. In particular, since the 18th CPC National Congress, the Party Central Committee, with comrade Xi Jinping at its core, has explored new ground in both the theory and practice of the system of People's Congresses. Some historic achievements have been made, and the system is more mature and better established. <laughs> Xijiming 民主集中制必须坚持中国特色社会主义政治发展道路必须坚持推进国家治理体系和治理能力现代化这六个必须坚持既是经验总结也是重要原则为新征程上长期坚持不断完善人民代表大会制度on the valuable experience in upholding and improving the system of people's congresses, General Secretary Xi Jinping gave a profound elaboration of upholding six principles at the Central Work Conference on People's Congresses in 2021. The six principles are upholding the leadership of the CPC, upholding people's running of the country with institutional safeguards, upholding law-based governance on all fronts, upholding democratic centralism, upholding the path of socialist political advancement with Chinese characteristics, and upholding the modernization of China's system and capacity for governance. The six important principles sum up our experience over many years and provide guidance for upholding and improving the system of People's Congresses on the new journey. Thank you. 
继续深入学习贯彻习近平总书记关于坚持和完善人民代表大会制度的重要思想，围绕全国人大成立七十周年举行多种形式的庆祝活动，加强对人民代表大会制度的宣传阐释，更好发挥人大的职能作用。The central task of the 14th MPC and its standing committee is to implement the guidelines of the 20th CPC National Congress and provide legal safeguard for building a great modern socialist country in all respects and advancing the great rejuvenation of the Chinese nation on all fronts through the Chinese path of modernization. We will continue to study the important thought of General Secretary Xi Jinping on upholding and improving the system of People's Congresses, commemorate the 70th anniversary of the MPC with various events, do more to communicate to the public about the system, and better leverage the role of the People's Congresses. Yes, 依法治国，有机统一，发展全过程人民民主，更好把国家根本政治制度优势转化为治理效能。二是稳中求进，推动人大工作高质量发展，加强宪法实施和监督，加快完善中国特色社会主义法律体系。增强监督工作的针对性、时效性，支持和保障人大代表依法履职。三是全面推进人大自身建设，使人大成为自觉坚持中国共产党领导的政治机关，保证人民当家作主的国家权力机关，全面担负。宪法法律赋予的各项职责的工作机关，始终同人民群众保持密切联系的代表机关。First, we will uphold the unity between party leadership, the running of the country by the people, and law-based governance. Further develop whole process people's democracy and better turn the strength of China's fundamental political system into stronger performance in governance. Second, we will steadily advance high quality development of the work of people's congresses, enhance the constitution's enforcement and oversight, improve the socialist legal system with Chinese characteristics, make the oversight more targeted and effective, and support and safeguard deputies' performance of duties. Third, we will enhance the capacity building of the People's Congresses and better play its role as an institution under the leadership of the CPC, ensuring that the people around the country, performing its duties under the Constitution and laws, and always keeping close ties with the people. In 中国式现代化作为最大的政治，不忘初心，牢记使命，坚持好、完善好、运行好人民代表大会制度，为强国建设、民族复兴伟业保驾护航。谢谢。On the new journey, we will take advancing Chinese modernization as our central political task, stay true to the founding mission, and further uphold. Improve and apply the system of people's congresses, so as to provide better safeguard for building a great modern socialist country in all respects and advancing the great rejuvenation of the Chinese nation on all fronts. Thank you.